Okay, so this is for my Stacy friend that's going to... I hope she can help me with this. This is what I'm looking at here. Um, you can see the white. And I'll kind of tell you what it is. It's a gold uh, brisket from Snake Rivers. It is 14 and a half pounds. Uh, wow. I want to know if this is ready. And it looks like it is. I can bend it now. So I'm thinking I could actually... This is a wet age, uh, Stacy. just to let you know. It's a wet age brisket. It's not dry age. So uh, everything seems to be bending. It's a little stiff a little bit here too. If you really look at this, you can kind of see the marbling in this meat. It, it is really there. I'm just curious when I start to trim other areas around this when I start doing my trim it's going to marble too I see marbling in here as well uh, this looks like a good piece of meat um, I'm going to put toss this back in the fridge but I just want to see what your take is on this uh, you think I can actually maybe around noon or this evening I may do an all nighter and get that thing this bad boy uh, on that grill over there. Uh, I'll show you a little bit, Stacy, what this grill looks like. Uh, it's got three levels. This thing is solid as a rock that I bought. It is that thick. It, it's not double metal. This is a solid piece. It's a solid piece of metal, uh, aluminum. And it closes it's got a a gap right there that just traps it completely it doesn't have a seal this thing has at least a half an inch and somewhere between a quarter and a half an inch uh lip and then i have in here two gr grades down and then i have over here this so I just want to get your input, and then I'm going to be using these lumps here, Jealous Devil's Hardwood Charcoal, Lump Charcoal, along with, I'll either use my Hickory, I have some Hickory chips here from Western Barbecue Cooking Chunks. I have also apple and maple, and then if I want, I may put some of this on my drip pan, which is going to be that second level. The first level is going to be charcoals at the bottom, then the second will be my drip pan on the Kamado, and then the third will be this brisket. So I'm going to sign off right now, and give me your input on this, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you.